Hi, I'm Trev Hutchings, and this is how to create clean vocals in Cakewalk. Next. Here I have an audio track with some vocals recorded, but it needs cleaning up. Slipping under again. So click on the vocal track header to select the track. If the track plugins pane is not open at the bottom of the window, click on view. Then click on show track plugins. In the plugins pane, click on the plus icon. First, we will remove the unwanted noise between the vocals. So click on Dynamics. And then double click on Noise Gate. The Noise Gate reduces the volume of the track when the sound on the track is below the volume level set by the threshold. So, it basically mutes the track between the vocals. Attack sets how quickly the noise gate stops reducing the track volume, when the track volume is above the volume level set by the threshold. So basically acts as a fade in. Press on the attack knob and drag down to create a shorter fade in. or drag up to create a longer fade in. Here we want the vocals to be clean and sharp. So press on the attack knob and drag down so the attack text says one millisecond. Release sets how quickly the noise gate starts reducing the track volume when the track volume is below the volume level set by the threshold. So basically acts as a fade out. Press on the release knob and drag down to create a shorter fade out. Or drag up to create a longer fade out. Here we want the vocals to be clean and sharp. So press on the release knob and drag down so the release text says 100 milliseconds. Threshold sets the volume level that triggers the noise gate to start reducing the volume when the track volume is below the threshold or stop reducing the volume when the track volume is above the threshold. Here we want to set the threshold to the same volume as the quietest vocals. So press on the threshold knob and drag all the way up. Then click on the play icon and then press on the threshold knob and drag down until all the vocals can be heard but the noise between the vocals cannot be heard. Slipping under again. Slipping under again. Slipping under again. Slip. Next, we will remove any low frequency rumble from the vocals that can muddy up the vocals and make them hard to mix. So click on the plus icon. Click on tone. 
then click on Graphic EQ. Then click on Add. Now press on the 100 Hz knob and drag down so the 100 Hz text says minus 15 dB. Slipping under again. Finally, we will add a compressor to even out the volume of the vocals. So the vocals are easier to mix and sound cleaner and sharper. So click on the plus icon. Click on Dynamics. Then double click on Digicomp. The Digicomp will reduce the volume of the loudest vocals. Attack sets how quickly the louder vocals are reduced in volume. It is currently set to 18 milliseconds. So the first 18 milliseconds of the louder vocals will not be reduced. Here we want as much of the louder vocals reduced in volume as possible. So press on the attack knob and drag down so the attack text says one millisecond. We will leave all the other knobs set as default. Slipping under again. OK, now we have our clean vocals. If you want to add any other effects, you can add them after the Digicomp. If you enjoyed this video, do give us a thumbs up and click on that subscribe button. Cheers!